Hi everybody, how's it going? Say hello. Hi. <laughs> Uh, my name is Dylan. This is Crystal. She is my great friend and today we are gonna be going over her car She just got a brand new Porsche <laughs> or was is it a Lamborghini? Oh, no, it's a what is it? <laughs> it's a Nissan Altima. <laughs> it's a Nissan Altima. Um, why don't you go ahead and introduce yourself really quick? Okay, I'm Crystal. I'm a freelance makeup artist and I drive Uber and Lyft on the side part-time Yeah, so I brought her over because I wanted to basically show you guys her car She's an Uber driver, part-time. She's like many of you guys, you know, working on other stuff as well. So we're gonna look over her car, uh, look at her setup, so you guys can get some good ideas for yourself because I have a feeling you guys are gonna learn a thing or two from <laughs> Crystal's setup because she is absolutely killing it. All right, <laughs> So <Don't> judge me. <laughs> so before we do get started, we just wanna urge you guys to subscribe to this channel. We are coming out with great Uber, Lyft, Related content videos on how to make money on other ways too. Like I even went out and did Instacart the other day Delivered groceries to people's homes and over in one day we made over $100 So it's like I'm always looking at new cool ways to make more money. So yeah, definitely subscribe, right? Yes, subscribe subscribe now <laughs> subscribe, to <the> channel. <laughs> subscribe to the channel and hit the thumbs up button Sorry, I think you have like Starburst in your hand, right? I do. Can you show the camera? I can't wait to eat. <laughs> <laughs> we were eating some from the cargo snack box. So, anyways, let's go to let's go let's go check out your car. Where yeah, is it? Where is it at? In the front. It's in the driveway. Can you can you guide us? Yes. Come on, guys. It's right over here. <laughs> All right, so let's go check out your car. Oh yeah. God damn, look at that car. Look at that beauty. It's a Nissan Altima 2016. Wait, say that again to the camera. More like. It's 2016 Nissan Altima. Okay, any special specs on it? Is it sport edition or? Not sport, it's just normal. Nissan Altima. Okay, cool. 2016. Yeah. All black, right? All black. Good so head. first thoughts, like, it's definitely a, it's definitely an Uber car. <laughs> <laughs> no, it is a cool car. I do have a black car as well. Um, Passengers love this car, okay? Sorry, it's kind of noisy out here. Yeah, it's kind of. I don't know about this street that I live on. Regardless, let's do your car tour, guys. You're just gonna have to, you know, face the all the random cars driving by in the background. Okay. All right, so, like I said, passengers like the Nissan Altima because it's so roomy in the back, so you can get in the back. Ooh. Chilling in the back okay. seat. So here, you can show me. See, I actually have tons of room in here. Yeah. So. See? Tons of room. And then, <clears throat> dang, I have like tons of room. I feel like I'm in like a, I feel like I'm in first class. <laughs> um, okay, and then go ahead and put down like the middle, the center console. This thing? Yeah. Ooh. So chilling. there you go. There's the cup holder right there. I put my phone in here, like. Phone. Like I'm in an Uber pool, like. Um, what chilling. else do you want me to go over? Um, yeah, let's, uh, ooh, what's this that you have right here? Okay, so Maybe this... you should get in the back and then, um, I'll, <laughs> you can show. So, like, I just wanted to show that I can fit in there comfortably. Okay, I have more than enough room. Do you keep your almost. seat, like, far up, or is that how you normally yeah, drive? I, like, drive kind of <laughs> up. I was like, there's so much room back there. It's, um, I don't, I don't need, like, a whole lot of room. Yeah. yeah. This, a friend actually suggested for me to do this because their friend is a photographer and drives for Uber and Lyft and oh. put their portfolio in. So do you, car. is that your portfolio? No, this is just my work. So like the cover, I did her makeup. No way. Yeah. So, Wait, is, is that your book or no? No, it's just like the ultimate bridal event. Oh, okay. Picture. So I have an ad in here though. Ooh, my phone nice. <laughs> I mean, you might get some customers from here, honestly. 
I don't know if you want that. Yeah, of course. <laughs> but, um, I don't want randoms calling me. <laughs> Definitely. Didn't you say you already got some DMs from guys on from the Redshare Hub? <laughs> got some DMs. Goes down in the DM. Guys, come on, don't be creepy, okay? <laughs> Some of you guys were sending, did, did they send you anything creepy or no? It, not really creepy or anything. If I just don't respond, I just don't have time to answer all of your questions. No unsolicited, unsolicited, um, you know, pics. Here's your phone. Oh, thank you. Um, some guy was sitting in the front seat earlier, or yesterday. Uh-huh. Want to check that out? Are those them? No. Oh, okay. Mine. So somebody left something in your car. Yeah. So, how does that work? Is he, I mean, are you going to meet up with oh. him and give him? Let me show you this. I'll try to hide your, uh... Optimal. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Trunk Ooh. space. I'm going to get rid of this. You do have an Ultima. Let's return. There you go. All this trunk space. Nice. Got a nice little There's cover, a too. wheel in there. Ooh, fun. You can transport things for people. There's a lot of room them. in there. I honestly room. could probably fit in there. You probably can. <laughs> Should I try? <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, there's your license plate, whatever. Oh. <laughs> uh, let's let's talk about this for a second. What is going on here? Cause this? Okay, it's so like, like, I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's like, it's hang barely, it's hanging yeah, on for dear a life. A lot of times I take this off and put it back on and take it off and put it back and on. And the adhesive if I'm just, going to, like, I do that hometown, too a lot, yeah. Or like, if I'm going out somewhere, I'm like, I don't want people to know yeah. I don't yeah. know why, but. I mean, I go on like dates sometimes and I, I'm not gonna leave my stickers on like it just Or just driving to the airport like if you're picking up your friend like not uber Oh, yeah, you don't want that on there cuz they're pretty strict. They are pretty strict. So like it just lost its tackiness Yeah, so I put glue or not glue tape. Yeah tape right there. What what's your phone setup like do you have like a car mount a phone mount? Where do you put your phone? Oh, you have that right there yeah. That's cool, actually. Oh, here are the keys. Passenger keys. They left this in my car. Oh, yeah. So, so yeah, what's going on with that? Are you going to meet up with him or something? Yeah, I'll probably... I'll have to return his keys later. Gotcha. And you'll get paid, it's like, annoying. 15 bucks, though, right? It's, like, 15 bucks, but... Why don't you see. have him meet you somewhere by your house? I... Yeah, I can do that, too. Yeah. Whatever. Okay, so there's... So here's quick interior. This is... Well... Let's just do, before I do the interior, let me just do a full walk around okay. of your car on the outside. Just because it wouldn't, is that okay? Yeah. Why are you laughing? As long as I don't get deactivated or anything like that. Wait, why would you get deactivated? A little dent or... Oh. <laughs> why? Are you worried about something? Um, <laughs> oh, okay. All right. Well, I just, it's a car tour. I just want to show you guys. This is just what it looks like. From the inside and outside. Like you gotta show the outside, pretty much. Okay, now let's do the ins, this is the inside. So, cup holder has a little screen right here that shows what song you're playing. So if people Fancy. like your music, they know. Your phone mount, talk about that. This, I have a Vulcan phone mount. This hooks up to your air vent, you just, Put it on right there and you mount your phone. Yeah. Um, Mine sticks to the actual windshield, so it's kind of annoying. Yours is like, I need one of those. This one's annoying because if you want to put on hot air or warm oh, it air, like it will heat up your phone. Oh, that's and annoying. Your, yeah, and then your phone will like. So, what do you do down. when you turn the heater on? You um, take your phone off? I have to, yeah, either I take my phone off or I just go back and forth between hot and cold. <laughs> oh my god, so annoying. <laughs> You don't want it to get too hot either. This and then, is, are these for passengers? Nuts. These these nuts and stuff? Uh, they can be because I haven't eaten them in like <laughs> a long time. They're salted, so. Okay. Do you do you say like, oh, help yourself with the nuts and the? <laughs> no, oh, I okay. never. <laughs> but like, I guess if somebody were really hungry, I would offer them. <laughs> Why not? Yeah, and then also, guys, like I just noticed here, it's a little bit dirty. Cause it rains. Cause it rains, but like. It's much more important to keep the inside clean. If the, I mean, yeah, like, yeah, obviously there's a few things here and there, but like that, if, if the outside is dirty, like passers do not really care. They much care more about the inside and like the personality of the driver. Yeah, if I they, think 
if they see like a dirty car, they don't, in my opinion at least, they don't really care too much. Yeah, I feel like I've had my car a little bit <coughs> dirtier on the inside Yeah. at one point, and even then, passengers were like, your car is so clean. Yeah. I don't know what some of you guys are doing. Some of them are really bad, so. Yeah. But yeah. That's well, dirty to me. Yeah. I mean, yeah, obviously like, there's a little bit, I mean, it's like normal wear and tear. Yeah. If you're thinking about like using your car, you're not sure. Like your car doesn't need to be perfect. It doesn't need to be. Perfect. My car is not perfect, so. Yeah, you just as long as there's no like cracks in your windshield or like. Actually, when I got my car inspected, I had a crack right here, and um, the guy was like, "Oh, I shouldn't be passing your car," but he did pass it anyways. He just told me to get it fixed. So like, if you have stuff like that, try to get it fixed before you do your inspection. But like other than that, this is a great car. 2016 you said what's the mp what's the miles per gallon on here it's about 24 miles per gallon that's pretty oh oh okay. highway. that's pretty good yeah. um i switched from a maxima to an ultima just because i was doing oh really yeah. did you trade in or did you sell okay gotcha um did you get from the dealership or a private from the dealership oh, i guess it is or did you uh, buy from off craigslist or something i bought it from nissan okay in, um, and so, out of 10, like, how do you rate this car? This car, for I've Uber. never had an issue with it, and Nissan service is amazing. Yeah. So, um, I rate it a 9. 9 out of 10? Yeah. Dang, that's pretty dang good. See, it's not the car, like, it's not my dream car or anything, yeah. but I mean, for a car, reliable car. Like, yeah, it's good. It's great. Yeah. Um, and then, how many miles do you have on the car? Do you know? I have about 96,000. 96? Okay, cool. Um, yeah, and how much do you know? How much you spent on the car? I spent. Or like, how much did the car cost when you bought it? Like like 20, 23000 Yeah. yeah. Um, cool. I mean, anything like you want people to know about it? Um, if they're thinking about buying a Nissan or an Altima, mm -hmm. do you have? Is there anything you don't like about it? Anything? I wish it had a sunroof. Sunroof. <laughs> So that's an extra. Yeah. Maybe if it had a sunroof, it'd be like 9.5 out of 10. Yeah. Maybe like, like, <laughs> yeah. Um, anything else? No, I mean... How's the vision? Is it good, like, rear view, mirror? Like, how are the mirrors? Mirrors are good. This one's great. The side mirror, yeah. Yeah, and, uh... <clears throat> It tells you what your tire pressure is. Oh, really? Yeah. Like it says how what the current pressure is. Uh huh. Like so thirty or whatever. Road or whatever. It would say like thirty-two, thirty-two. No way. Mine does not say that. It doesn't. No. Yeah, that's like helpful. <laughs> I have to go out and like kick the tire and be like, oh, I think it's good. <laughs> yeah, oh, how your tires. how fast does it go? Does it go pretty fast or pretty? Because it's a ne Nissan's generally go decently fast, right? Um, it goes. It goes a solid, I mean, it goes like nicely. Like, are you ever like, oh, come on, like go faster, or no? No, yeah. I, it, and it goes up hills like pretty at a decent speed, yeah. Yeah. you know? Like, it's still going 70 up a hill and everybody else's car is like slowing down. What do you think, or how, what other cars have you driven? So you had a Maxima before? Yeah, I had a Nissan. Did you have any other cars before? Um, a Chevy Cavalier. Chevy Cavalier. Yeah. Ooh, wait, is that a SUV? No, it's like a. It was a coupe. Okay. And it's like a smaller car. Did you do you like this one better than that or? Way better. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Way better. Throwing oh. shit, throwing shade on the Chevy. <laughs> so. Yeah, um, Chevy. So yeah. Me, the Chevy gave me a lot of problems. So. Gotcha. I mean, this is 90, 90 something thousand. Still no problems. Like major problems, right? What? Did you buy it used or new? This I car. I bought it used. Okay. Gotcha. So, how many miles did you buy it with? You know, seven thousand. Seven thousand. Yeah. Okay. So you put on like ninety almost. Mm -hmm. Cool. Um, that's pretty smart to buy it. Like it's almost like new, but yeah. it's, it's just depreciated. Like it's main bigger value. So, because um, if you bought it new, it probably would be like thirty or something. Like after taxes and everything. Yeah. That's so, true. but yeah, guys, that's it for the car tour. That's a that's pretty general overview of crystals. 2016 Nissan Altima, great car for Uber, highly recommend it. Mm -hmm. um, 2016, 
it's a pretty good year. Um, yeah. You don't need a brand new car for Uber. <laughs> it has a backup camera too. I forgot to mention that. Oh, really? It has a backup cam. Oh, that's helpful. It is helpful. <laughs> totally helpful when parallel parking. Does it have sensors like if you accidentally get too close to another car or no? No. Okay. What was that? <laughs> I got some interesting people on this yeah, street. The gardeners. <laughs> cool. Well, anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. If you did enjoy it, make sure to hit the thumbs up button and also we also want to urge you guys to subscribe to this channel uh, if you want to be notified when we do post videos crystal is going to be on here from time to time now so um, if you want to see her click subscribe if you want to see me click subscribe <laughs> I don't know who wants to see me I think they're all here for you <laughs> but anyways guys thank you so much for watching today's video we will talk to you all soon have a great day guys peace out